it is always complicated to explain to academics what we do because what we do somehow uh, fits within an academic model and yet reaches beyond it. In, in my work and in the Smart Lab work in general, the, the questions that we ask and tend to address in all of our research programs come from really basic um, human interaction. They come from someone communicating to me, ringing me, saying, um, my daughter uh, needs a communication device, can you help? Or um, uh, my sister has just experienced some horrendous abuse, do you have any tools that you could make to assist her? Are there any programs that could connect to her? Those questions come individually and also collectively through major research programs. My aim and Smart Lab's aim is to try to address those real needs directly. So we never just cook up a big idea that we think would be cool or fun and then try to convince somebody to fund us to play around with it. Um, though play can lead to very useful results, but the play process for us is integrated into very real world um, driven outcomes. Somebody actually can't move and needs a communication device. We'll take that as our challenge, we'll put together a team and we'll play with that person who needs it and amongst ourselves to create that tool. Until practice informs policy in a much more direct way and there's a two-way dance literally between those two, um, progress is still slow. So uh, what I would love to see is the models that we work with um, embedded in government, embedded in policy, um, embedded in schools, um, uh, in a much wider, more inclusive way, and then that kind of multicultural, multi-generational, uh, multi-ability dance between all those sectors would have a much greater impact much faster.